I have let y'all down. It was months ago at this point that I did my first video on Hasbin Hotel, and then I did a video on Hell of a Boss. And yet, guess which awful YouTuber hasn't done a video on those two original songs associated with Hasbin Hotel, Insane and Addict? This guy. I tell ya, I have had so many comments about these. So, you know, I'm I'm glad. I'm glad we're getting to it. I'm I'm so ready. Before we start, I thought I'd let you know that I have a Patreon. You can get all kinds of cool perks over there, including an uncut reaction once per week. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in, the link will be in the description below. Let's start this one off with Insane. It's created by Black Griffin and Basic. Dearly beloved, for your entertainment. Uh. You know, I'm not gonna lie, I completely forgot the style and vibe that Hasbun Hotel has. So I wasn't exactly prepared for swing, would you call it? Don't get me wrong, I am so glad. Oh my god, I'm stupid. I was like, oh, funny that Black Griffin's doing a song on Hasbun Hotel. Guess who forgot he's, he's in it. Hello, it's nice to meet you. Can you tell me where I am? I'm always gonna love the old timey filtered vocals. I don't belong among the angels, and maybe that's just fine with me. And I love when people keep their beats as simple as they can be, like they don't overcomplicate it. I'm assuming that it's gonna hit a bit later, but at the moment it's very bare bones. And that means that right now I can focus on the performance of the voice. But now I'm going for my degree. Hey, sorry, oh. just got in my They're slowly layering in more. I thought they'd go for a big bang. Also didn't see the offbeat coming in that line. Oh my god. Dude, electro swing, it slaps. Anyone who thinks it doesn't can fight me. Here's what I'll say though. One thing I'm minorly concerned about, but also I guess it doesn't matter too much because the song's not too long, but I'm a little worried that if they do another repetition or two of that chorus and it doesn't change, it might get a little bit stale. It feels like there's a chance that that chorus will just be the same. I really hope I'm wrong, but also it's the kind of thing that even if they change it like slightly, it'll still keep me engaged. Whatever that sound is, especially with the clock, creepy af. Maybe you have what I need. Please stop making me stare down his eyes. That'd be really nice. Cool slowdown. That's nice. Oh, man. The way those drums come in and the beat they choose to come in on is so good. And they're paired so nicely with the rhythm of that melody. I'm not even talking about the delivery of the vocals. It's literally just the pattern of the notes coming in there. It's one of those situations where I feel like the choices they've made are a little bit outside of what would naturally and immediately occur to someone when they listen to the beat. It feels as though quite a bit of thought has gone into the composition there. I'm ready to be hit again. I can't, I can't actually tell if that's any different. I was so engrossed in the rest of it. Oh. I love the way the synths kind of phase in and out. It gives this really weird effect. There you go, it's a, they added the vocals over it. That's a nice addition. And weird harmonizing vocals. Yeah, I was gonna say, I just looked at the time code. There's only like 20 seconds left. I'm quite surprised we only really got essentially two choruses. I was expecting three. That second one was bigger and I really, really liked that and also introduced a couple of different elements. The harmonies like that, great idea. That really helped to take that to the next level. Now I'm wholeheartedly expecting something creepy to end out this video. I mean, just look at the visual we're getting. I don't like that. That's my sleep paralysis demon. I just realized his like mouth is lighting up when he speaks. Yep. Don't like that. <sighs> With all of my heart, I was expecting to be jump scared there. I don't know if you know me, but that ain't, that ain't my thing. Don't get me wrong, I wasn't really creeped out by the song itself, but just when they have those prolonged stares, I get paranoid, all right? Overall, pretty slappy. I like that they kept it short and sweet. It felt like exactly what needed to be in there was in there. And that also really helped curb the potential problem where it could get boring or repetitive. I didn't feel that at all. Ultimately, that just comes down to good choices. Can someone answer me? Why wasn't that in the pilot? I'm assuming time? You could even use a portion of that. Oh wait, no, but that was written by Black Griffin. Oh, so he just did that as like auxiliary, like what promotion? Oh, that's cool. I didn't even think of that. That's such a good idea for like promoting a series, kind of extending the universe like that, especially for something on YouTube. I like that a lot. And I think they've done a 
similar thing here with this one because this one is angel dust and is on the official channel so they've used it as a way to extend the universe even more it feels like there's so much character development going on the other song we're listening to today is called addict Oh my god, okay. I was like, oh yeah, it's got graphic language, adult content, and flashing lights. Great. And then there was just, it just kept going. This warning was four lines. Also, is it gonna be pole dancing? All right. Time for me to shift gears, especially from the last one. Getting hot in here, or is it? <laughs> wait a, wait a damn minute. Is Angel Dust a spider? Maybe I didn't notice that he had more than one pair of limbs. Very opening of the episode, he has like six fingers. And he clicks. And I loved that. I just never put together the fact that it, that it was spider-esque. Oh my god, can you imagine Angel Dust as Peter Parker? Till death do us part, but we're I guess I wasn't fully expecting auto-tune, but it, it works. And I think I deserve some praise for the way that I am. It's a nice rundown. This is so poppy, what the hell? This is the mantra, this is my life. How dance synth is this gonna be? I thought it was gonna hit there, but we're getting a pre chorus build. Damn, who's the backing vocals? Those are awesome. Whoever she is, they sound so good, and she is like made for this style of music. This feels like 2000s, I'm here for it. Not the notes that I was ready for, but the notes that I needed. Oh my gosh. The production quality is higher than I was ready for. I like that it's like slightly offbeat too. Also, I'm just realizing, are we getting a bit of context for the start of the pilot? Because that seems like the setup to like the very first minute. So count your blessings cause this is it. You're not letting it go. Oh man, deeper notes sound lovely. You already know. So come if you're feeling right. Some really nice runs too. I want to hear vocals over that synth chorus. To the madness, this hotel is my it's a nice simple slide for the pre-chorus. Oh, syncopated snare hits. That's what I need. <laughs> oh my gosh. The corset does look so good. Making me want to do an Angel Dust cosplay, not gonna lie. I could pull it off, right? Tell me, couldn't I pull it off? <laughs> oh my god, and the glasses. Oh, let me get some of them. Sing, sing over this. I want to hear it so bad. What's up with the videos I've been watching lately and making me want to literally absolutely dance in a club? This is insane. I shouldn't be watching a music video for the extended universe of a YouTube animation and be like, yeah, it's time to do shots. That's what I wanted to hear. But now give me some like longer, extended, even high notes. Oh. There was so much more in the video, I thought that it was gonna keep going. Oh, dude. The credits coming in on the bass. I'm so glad I didn't stop. I was I was about to like be like, oh, well, the video's over, but... What a funky ass bass line. That wasn't in the rest of the song, was it? No, this is definitely a new bass line. Then clean piano, oh my gosh. What's the little pig? That's adorable. Maybe things won't be so terrible inside this hotel. Yeah, wow, they really went for some character development at the end there. Hot damn, I feel like I got to know Angel Dust a bit more over the course of this video. But also, my gosh, was nobody gonna prepare me for absolute slappage? I need to be told in advance when someone's gonna just hit me in the face. I, I hope that's okay. Is that an arrangement we can make going forward? <laughs> just when you suggest a video, say, hey, you should really listen to Addicts from Hasbun Hotel. By the way, just so you know, your head's gonna explode. Hope that's cool. Figured I'd let you know. Because while I like having my head intact, I am willing for it to explode for the right reason. And I feel like that's 
that's a sentiment that everyone should have in their lives. Be protective of your head. But you know, if you're gonna let it explode, make sure it's for something good. That is to say, I liked that. I liked that a lot, actually. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to click that like button. And as always, have an awesome time until I see you next. See ya.